One of the great features of having a Chromebook with a stylus is the stylus tools. So when you have an EMR enabled stylus, it pulls up the stylus tools and you're able to do various things with it. So let's start with the capture region. And that just allows you to do this screenshot by selecting part of the screen. It'll pop up right away and ask you to copy or annotate. I'm just gonna copy this one. Go to a Google Doc here, and then you can quickly be able to long press with your stylus and paste it in into a document or slides presentation or, or wherever you wanna put it. So that's a nice feature. Another thing you could do with it, let's say I use the stylus tools and I hit the capture screen, it'll do the entire screen. I can quickly hit copy to clipboard, go below here one row. And this time what I could do is I could just go up here to the edit and hit the paste button. That's another way that you could quickly be able to paste that into a document or slides presentation, et cetera. Another nice feature is that if you do take a screenshot or I just capture a region like so, just dragging the stylus across the screen, there's an annotate image icon that pops up. This will then proceed to upload it by default to Google Keep. Google Keep has some awesome stylus tools. You're able to annotate over the top of the picture as you wish. Has several different pens that you can choose from. Uh, has a highlighter tool. You can change the colors of these at any time by selecting the arrow beside those. You can also choose different papers, but you don't necessarily need that for uh, over the top of the picture. Uh, you do have an eraser if need be, and it erases very quickly when you do so. And then you also have a capture or a grab tool that allows you to grab multiple drawings and move them around and resize them. To shrink them down, I use my fingers for that. All right, so then when you're done with a picture, let's say you've annotated it and you've marked it the way that you want, then what you can also do is you can quickly click on the three dots over here and you can download it. And when you've done that, then you're able to just copy it, go to your document or wherever you wanna place it and paste it in. And so now I have my picture with my annotations over the top. Another option would have been to hit the insert icon since I'm in a Google Doc and go to the drawing tool, hit a new one. And I could have also pasted these images in directly right here in the Google drawing. And then I could switch to the scribble tool here in Google drawings. It's not near as smooth as drawing using Google Keep, but it is an option that's built right into a Google Doc. I'll hit save and close, and it'll put those directly into the document. So that is a quick way that you are able to utilize those stylus tools. Some other nice features, you can also hit create note. This will open up Google Keep, just a blank note right away, and then you're able to just draw directly on this board if you need lined paper or squares or dots, then you're able to annotate kind of a cool feature. And then again, you can take those notes and you can download them and place them elsewhere if need be. Close out of that. Another nice tool is if you are utilizing Google Cast for Education, let's say you're casting your screen up to a projector or a TV, then you can utilize the laser pointer, point out different things that are on the screen using your stylus. And you have a cool magnifying glass tool so that way you can zoom in on specific parts and students can see it much better as you are projecting your screen. So those are some of the cool stylus tools that are built into a Chromebook when you flip it back and you have an EMR enabled stylus.